continue trying to pursue women even though they said no bro the, ga the girl said no bro what you what are you trying to do what's up guys here with you with another video today i'm discussing six mistakes that men do on the first day i'm excited for this one let's get to the video so mistake number one and this one is so common is staring at her for too long Listen, if you're staring at a girl for too long, this is what happens. You're going to make her feel like she's better than you. You're giving her validation that she hasn't earned. Do not do it. If you're staring at her, you come across as a creep. Do not do it, guys. You need to just give eye contact and she gives you that eye contact back. Then you can pursue further. But you looking at her like, oh, oh, look at that girl. You come across that like you haven't seen a girl with a boobs or ass before. You've got to make it look like she is... A regular girl trust me if you're gonna keep it looking at her and making her like she's a dream girl she's gonna look at you like wow this guy I, I did find him attractive but now the way he's looking at me I've, I've seen him less valuable because he's seen me like some prize prize at least I'm not wearing makeup girls yeah when you give them validation especially when you're on the worst day and you're looking at me like oh my days oh, oh, oh. she'll be like I'm on my best day and this guy's making me feel like some queen she hasn't earned that validation don't give it to her get eye contact eye contact first then you can pursue further. And again, staring is not the same as getting eye contact. Don't stare at her for too long because you're going to look desperate. Trying to gain eye contact, if she looks at you, look at her, then look away. Carry on doing your thing, especially at the gym. I see guys stare at girls. Ah, oh, guys go to the gym and they're hungry for girls. They must be looking at her, chasing her around the whole gym, working out where she works out. Like, look, 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 look. You're looking crazy. You're looking desperate. You don't need to do that. What you need to do is, Trying to get eye contact, if she looks at you, look at her, give her a nod and carry on benching, doing your thing. Because now she sees that, oh, this guy is a confident man. He's not trying to get, get my interest, he's just doing his thing. He's just doing his thing. This is normal for him. Like, you looking at her for so long, it makes you look like you don't see pretty girls often. Mistake number two, do not, and I repeat, do not lead with a compliment. You're giving her validation that she hasn't earned. Listen, women want the best guy. I mentioned this in my previous video. They want to feel that they are trying to attract the best guy. And if you make her feel that she's better than you, she's going to put you in a friend zone or worse, just don't even chat to you. So you need to not get, give her that validation by saying, oh, yeah, you're very beautiful, you know. Don't give her a compliment. If she's earned it now, then you can say, like, oh, say something about the workout. Oh, you're doing that. That's a good workout you're doing there. Don't be giving her a compliment about how she looks because now she's going to be like, oh, my days is so excited. And it plays with their head and they get excited. Listen, women get excited when you give them a compliment. You add you to another group of guys that's already giving them validation. Trust me, these women are getting validation from so many men. Do not add to that list because you become across as a groupie. The average chick is getting validation on the DMs, on the road. Do not add to that by saying, you're looking beautiful today. Oh, oh, nice, 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 nice dress. She's going to be like another groupie. Check. And she's going to be so excited, going off a day happy. Don't do that. Just be like, yeah, you're right, okay, <laughs> whatever. And carry on doing your thing, because now she'll be like, oh, my days, this guy don't see me as that girl. No, because there's many pretty girls. But when you know your worth, there ain't many guys like you. Be different. Don't be that guy in the DMs and be like, oh, my days, you're so big. They'll be giving that, they'll be gassing this woman up. I'm like, bro, you all just make this woman's head more bigger. Don't do it. Don't do it. And another thing to remember is, when you meet a girl, you got to be vetting her out. Don't be looking like you need to be in her life. She needs to be like, she needs someone like you in her life to better her life. And that's when you come across. Come across confident and be like, listen, if you meet a guy like me, your life will change because I bring a different type of value. Don't be looking at her and think, oh my days, if I have a girl like this, my life will change and I'll get respected for my friends. Nah, don't do that because now you should put in a groupie category and that's it, friend zoned. And she'll use you to get an ego more bigger. Don't do that, guys. Trust me, don't do it. Mistake number three. Listen, do not come across hurried to speak to her. Like you're just trying to get through the through the, your, your, your conversation. You're coming across too eager. Be calm and collective. I mentioned this in my previous video. When you come across very eager to speak to her, she's gonna feel like, man, this guy doesn't, he ain't used to speaking to girls. He's trapped in the basement somewhere. <laughs> like, huh, huh, huh. Now you finally get out, you finally get out and you see a girl and you're excited to see her. Don't do it lads, listen. Be calm and be like, hi. Like speak to many pretty girls. I like to speak to many pretty girls and she's another one and he'd be like, listen, you okay? Yeah, enjoy your workout or yeah, enjoy your day. Don't be acting like you know I mean? she's the first time you've seen a girl with some ass or some titties. Listen, don't give her that validation, man. Don't do it. 
Mistake number four. Listen, guys. <laughs> take care of your oral hygiene. Actually, take care of your hygiene in general. Having bad breath is a put off to women. Listen, you want to be talking to a woman, you have got hot breath, you're like, hello. Hello, and she smells that whiff. Listen, that's a put off. That's it. Your day's done. You can be handsome. If your bad breath, if your, if your breath is bad, forget it. That's done. You're, you're finished out here. Carry mint, guys. Make sure you're carrying mint. You're carrying some sort of um, peppermint, pepper spray. You're getting your breath in check. Because trust me, having bad breath is not the one. You need to be brushing your teeth twice a day, man. That one time a day is not working. You need to be brushing and flossing those teeth. Because if you start getting the bacteria built up in your teeth, you're going to have bad breath. And you mean speak to women and smell that that smelly ass breath coming out of your ass, man. That's gonna that's gonna ruin your day. It's gonna ruin your night. It's gonna be a long night for you. Trust me, you don't want that. <laughs> Trust me. Make sure your breath is on point. Make sure you're using the right equipment when it comes to washing your mouth. Tongue scrubbing, the flossing, you know, mouthwash, the antibacterial stuff to remove that dead ass breath you have. Because trust me, it's not going to work for you. Having a bad breath, it ruins you, not even with women, in friendship as well. You, people want to talk to you be like, man, that guy over there has got shit breath. You won't be that guy where people are chatting, to you, chatting behind your back and are calling you shit breath. Don't do that. So make sure you carry the right products, peppermint spray, um, freaking whatever you need to do, chewing gum. Make sure you sort that breath out or you're, you're done out here. Mistake number five is do not try overly to impress her. Listen, I've seen guys try too hard using too much games and words to try to impress her and all you're doing is, is giving her more validation. Do not do that. Be calm, be collective, say what you want, say what you, what you mean. Be yourself, that's more important. Be yourself. You're more than enough for her. Don't try to be something that you're not because when you do that, you're going to come across as eager, you're not used to speaking to women and she's going to be like, you know what, this guy, I can tell, He's not used to being around women, so I'm just going to be friends on him or just use him for my own validation purposes. Because women will use you for validation. I'm telling you now, they've got the guys that, they, that they're, trying to, they're trying to get the attention from. I'm telling you now, they've got guys they're trying to get attention from and they've got the guys that you use for validation. So they post a little pic so you can give them all their validation. Then they're going to use that to get the guy they want. Trust me, I've seen it all the time. Don't be that guy that you give her validation, but she's using your validation to try and get another guy to message her. Because trust me, they, they categorize guys, they categorize two of us. You're the guy that gives validation or the guy they're trying to pursue. Be the guy that they're trying to pursue. Don't be that guy that always gets light in her head like, oh my days, look at your body, you're so beautiful. Listen, she's not so beautiful, man. She's average. Don't gas her up. She's average like any other girl. Don't make her head get all swell and shit. Don't do it. You're going to come across as an eager, hungry, and needy man. Mistake number six, and this is the final mistake, but very, very important, and it's not to look at her for too long. And when I say don't stare at her for too long, like I mentioned in tip number one, is just have eye contact, but don't come across that you're trying to hunt her down, like you're looking at all those predators and see on TV. Listen, don't be sectioned again, put on TV, like watch out for this guy, the predator. Don't do that, because she, you, listen, she'll dial one number and you'll be on the Channel 4 News, like there's a predator out there looking crazy. Don't do it guys, trust me. Be, be calm, collective. Don't be acting crazy. Don't be up looking at her like you like you you haven't you haven't seen a girl in, in months. Shit, let alone yes. Be calm. Be like, hey, try to get eye contact. She gives you eye contact. Pursue further. She doesn't let her go. You know your value. If she, if she ain't interested in you, let it go, guys. Do not. I think guys continue trying to pursue women even though they said no. Bro, the, ga the girl said no, bro. What you what are you trying to do? You're making stupid now. And they just keep pursuing it. If the girl says no, leave her alone, bro. Because trust me, if you carry on leveling up, she's going to be watching you thinking, man, why did I turn this guy down? Don't be hungry for her, man, because you all look silly. Like, oh, why don't you want me? Why don't you want me? Look at me. Bro, you've already ruined your chances. Don't do it. Guys, there's a thin line between having good eye contact and coming across as a creep. Listen, I don't say don't look at the girl. Look at her, show that you're confident. Because if you, if you look at her and you keep looking down on the floor, that's also bad eye contact. Have good eye contact. Look at her. Don't be looking at her, chasing her around. Don't do that. Have a good eye contact. If she gives her eye contact back, give her a smile and carry on doing what you're doing. Just show that, listen, I, I see you. I know you see me, but I see you too. Yeah? And that's when she'll be like, oh, he, know, he, he acknowledges me, but he's not acting all creepy. She's going to find you way more attractive, guys. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Six mistakes that men do on the first date, first impression. Avoid it. If you like this video, click on the subscribe button and join the team, guys. FAQ Fitness, we're doing this FAQ Vlogs. Till next time, peace.